Hey guys, Christina here, and today I have a flip through and review of Apologia's Exploring Creation with Chemistry and Physics. This is part of the Young Explorer series. I have both the textbook and the notebooking journal to give you a look at. First, if you're new here, welcome. I'm Christina. I'm a mom of five. We live in the Canadian Maritimes, and currently my children are between the ages of six and 15, and we homeschool. So I'm gonna turn the camera around, give you a look through everything, then I'll come back here and share my thoughts on it with you. So we'll start with the textbook here. It is a hardcover textbook. That's how thick it is. So it starts off with just kind of your typical introductory stuff. The book is available, of course, the textbook. They also have the notebooks, which I'll show you, Notebooking Junior Editions. And they also have it available as an audiobook, this textbook. This is the scientific speculation sheet. This is the table of contents. So there's 14 lessons, they call them. I would call them units. So chemistry and physics matter, moving matter, building blocks of creation, compound chemistry, multitude of mixtures, mechanics in motion, dynamics of motion, work in the world, sound of energy, light of the world, thermal energy, electrifying our world, Mysterious Magnetism and Simple Machines. They also have, of course, like the index and the answer key, supply list. This is the introduction. It just tells you how to use this book step by step. Some of the other things you can add in. There is a code that comes in every book that you can put in on the website and it gives you extra information and resources to go along with each lesson. And it gets right into lesson one. I'll give you a quick flip through so you can see what lesson one looks like. These here, try this, are like the hands-on things you can do and there are quite a few of them in this book. There's pictures, the purple is where you would review, ask those review questions. Final matters, the what do you remember, so there's some questions there and the answers to these are in the back. Notebooking activities and a project and then on to lesson two. Let's have a look at the back here. So there is that index. There's the credits. These are the answers to those what do you remember and a few other questions throughout the book. This is the list of what you need, the supply list. And here's a flip through of the rest of the textbook. So we'll move on to the junior one now. Sorry, not the junior, the regular notebook. So the regular notebook is recommended for grades three to six. The junior one is grades, well, kindergarten to grade two. So I had two children using this book this year. So it starts off table of contents, same thing, kind of what's on what page, a note from the author, how to use this book. And then it gives you a schedule, which I really appreciate. It's a 28 week schedule. You can take it or leave it, adjust it for what you want, but I find it's a good breakdown when I'm trying to plan. And then it gets right in. So it always starts with notes in the beginning. And you'll see that there's empty parts in here because we didn't do them all. Then there's usually the copy work, the vocabulary crossword, and there's both um, printing and handwriting in this one. Some kind of activity like a flip book here. And then there's, um, project and other resources. So this is the what do you remember at the very end and then it moves on to the next lesson. So I'll show you some of the like mini books. It kind of opens to them all. So there's a variety of little mini book projects that they do. This one has it here. This one, a spinning one. Oh, there we go. So it's quite varied, but it all follows the same pattern in here. It is a soft cover, soft bound, and that's how thick it is. This course is recommended by Apologia for grade one through six. I had children in grade one, four, and seven use the course. My child in grade one, I did not get them that junior notebook. They just listened. Um, they did some of the hands-on activities with us. It was very casual in that way. 
The child in grade seven, he's the one who is most interested in these topics and I have had other children in grade seven use this series with no problem. So I felt like it was totally fine for him. I think Apologia does a very good, it's nice the way it's set up with the junior notebook and the regular notebook. You don't need the notebooks to do the course. You can just use the textbook. You can use the resources that come along with that code inside, add as much in, take as much out. Um, but I personally like the notebooks because everything is done for me and it's very open and go. And when I'm doing, how many, three sciences this year, <laughs> it'll be four next year. Um, it just, it keeps it simple for me. So I do appreciate those notebooks. I appreciate the schedule that they put in them. Now it is a Christian curriculum and I find it very religious. Um, so I do pare that back a bit for our family. It's a little too much for us at that time uh, when we're reading. I, I like the course overall. Now, that said, they are currently redoing all their Young Explorer series, so I don't know when this one is slated to get a new edition, but I have used a newer edition last year for a different topic within the series, and I prefer those new editions so much more than these ones. <laughs> so if you have a chance to wait, wait for the new edition. I find they are more colorful, there's more pictures, Things are explained in a clearer manner. Also, the notebooking journals are set up quite differently and I much prefer them than the way that these ones are set up. So that's just something to keep in mind if you are considering doing it. I would try and find out when they're gonna put that new edition out and maybe wait for it. But they cover a whole year of topics and there's lots of hands-on activities. Like I said, you can add in or take out make work for your family, for the ages you have, for what your children's interests are. I like the course. It works. It's affordable. I feel like it's fairly affordable. And yeah, we've used, like I said, a number of the Young Explorer series and probably will continue to. If you have any questions um, or have missed something, leave it in the comment section down below. I always do try to answer every comment that people leave and answer every question. Otherwise, though, I hope this finds you having a great day. Take care.